this video I'm going to show how to clone four incident zones into a BKR 5000. So we'll go ahead and start. This is the latest RES 5.8.20 as of April 2023. There will be probably another res coming out shortly along with the BKR 9000 radio that's about to hit the streets. So we'll go to tools. We're going to zone clone and we're going to do multiples. So I've zoomed this in as about as large as I can to to uh, allow you to see not just blurry vision but uh, hopefully what I'm doing here. So BKR 5000 has uh, got four extra zones this year for the ABCD toggle. So what I like to do is just line them up. And you can see they're not the same um, number. So what you could do if you want to maintain the same placeholder is you'll highlight it, let go, and then highlight it again and hold it down. And we're going to put it, we have to put it there in the incident zone. And that went proper. So we'll go ahead and say, yeah, I'm going to try to line this up. Next one, touch it, let go, and then touch it again and drag it over. And it went over fine. Do the same thing. Touch, release, drag. And touch, release, drag. So all of those are the way I want them. So I'm going to go ahead and write them. If, if you don't like it and it didn't land right, which happens quite a bit, just uh, eggs out and then do it again. So I'm going to go ahead and write the zones. Okay, it's written them. And the BKR is really quick. It's just reset. You can hear the USB driver. And within about five seconds, the USB driver is woke up. I'm ready to read or write. Um, so I'm going to do another clone. And this time, it's another multiple clone. But we're going to pretend that the uh, radio I'm connected to um, is not an agency radio. So we'll go down to these four here. And, you know, a lot of times the non-agency radios could have 32 zones. or Usually never is not as many as, as we have here. So I'm going to go ahead and touch and then hold down the shift. And touch again. So I got those four highlighted. I'm going to drop these four all at once below where everything is. So you can see I'm too far. And then there's the right spot. There's like a little, it's like a little uh, envelope. If I go too high, that's going to paste it above uh, zone D. So I'm going to let go. And now reveal. There they are. And you see those numbers. Well, I didn't put numbers in the in the uh, clone zone. If you look over here, there is this is the number that's supplied by the RES. Go ahead and write it. And listen, it just it just lost the USB. It's resetting. And it's already greened up and ready. These radios have significant more processor than the earlier ones. So uh, we don't have the problems with uh, failing to read and write like we had. So we should have two sets of uh, those zones. So this is like uh, statewide Armageddon, <laughs> the, fl the mud flood of 2023. So each one of those is in there. 
in the uh, standard clone zones, and then the other one I showed. Um, like if you're if you're just dropping it into somebody that doesn't have the same architecture, you just you could just put it in the bottom, like I did the second time, and probably the uh, radio tech probably won't have a coronary or an aneurysm when uh, the uh, firefighter heads back home with his radio. The, these are you know down below everything else shouldn't affect anything else in the radio so that's that <laughs>